Underworld Blood Wars 3D in this bitch. Let's talk about it. Hope you guys are doing good. Hope you guys are doing great. I know your boy's been on a 3D rampage at the moment, but that's because I'm awaiting some Blu-ray 4K transfers. I've got Underworld coming tomorrow, I think, in 4K, and then I've got Iron Man coming a few days later in 4K. You know that's going to be epic. You know you guys waiting for that, bitch. But before all that, for the new people, let me just introduce myself. It is Brass Tax in this bitch. You already know. Jesus Christ, I'm not well, you know. I can't breathe in this bitch. Could be all the KFC I've been eating lately. I don't know. I'm not going to talk about the movie. Because I already have a review on this movie. There's a link on the comment section. Okay, so you guys can watch it. It was a slightly drunk review, but your boy was on point regardless. I know I've said in previous reviews that I don't drink. I just don't like the taste of alcohol, so I don't drink. But I've been told by various different uh, nutritionalists that... Having, having a glass of brandy, like maybe once every couple of weeks, is really good for the blood and what have you. The problem with that is, is smart ass that I am, I usually have a glass of brandy on an empty stomach. You know, if you don't drink, you're a lightweight. So when I have the brandy, your boy get fucked up in this bitch. I'm gonna give you 100% real. So now you know, interesting fact. Now I remember Underworld Awakening was a really good 3D transfer. It was only one, right? It was only one prior to this, which was 3D, yeah. The one before this was an amazing transfer. Amazing transfer. This one, it's a conversion. It wasn't shot with 3D in mind. In some cases, it has great depth. I've watched the Blu-ray of this, the normal Blu-ray, and I've watched the 3D. And the 3D looks a little softer than the actual Blu-ray. Not by much, but just, just by a pubic hair, it looks a little bit softer. It's not going to blow you away by any stretch. There are no pop-out moments. There is a scene in the movie where Kate Beckinsale... Celine, she's going to kind of train some people and there is a scene where things are coming out of the screen I remember when I watched the blu-ray of that I was thinking okay this this will pop out of the screen in 3d and it didn't pop out It was struggling to pop out in this bitch. So in that respect It is just your run-of-the-mill 3d transfer nothing really amazing. Yeah, it's got nice depth I'm measuring it against the previous underworld movie in 3d and I'm also measuring it against other things You've got great titles like Doctor Strange Fantastic Beasts is also another good title. You're, you're measuring it against them There is depth to this and you do see layers But the layers don't feel like layers in this bitch. There's not a three-dimensional depth to it There's just depth to it if you're gonna pick it up with a 3d don't be expecting anything Wow, I can't think of any standout moments from this disc. I know my boy is over at Spare Change, got the 160, 126 inch projector in this bitch. So I would imagine now whatever you see on that, whether it be 4K or 3D, it's going to be a lot more immersive. I totally understand that. That being said, there's depth to it, but nothing's going to blow you away. Now, I was expecting to be blown away because I had heard that the 3D in the cinema of this was A1. Okay. To me, it didn't translate well to Blu-ray. You might want to wait for the 4K of this because number one is Sony, number two, it was shot in 6K, and number three, it's a 4K DI. I'm expecting a really good transfer. So I don't know. Kate Beckinsale looked beautiful in 3D. Let's not fuck around. Kate Beckinsale, I once again, baby. I am so sorry I didn't put you in my top 10. I'm gonna revise that bitch and put you maybe top five because you do look beautiful. You look very nice in 3D. I'm hoping you look even better in 4K, baby. That's it. Hit the like button if you liked it. Definitely subscribe if you haven't already. And I'm going to catch you guys soon.